She was told it couldn't be done, but today as thousands watched, a Shiloh woman proved the naysayers wrong. CW 11's Tony Miller has the story of a single mom's fight to make a better life for her children. She was 16 and pregnant, and it seemed her life was over. I dropped out of high school uh, right before I had her, and I heard in high school that, you know, I wasn't going to be able to finish, and I wasn't going to be able to go any further, and, you know, I need to just stay home. She would go on to have six more children, but this single mother never gave up on her dream of becoming a nurse. And today at SIU at Edwardsville, as her children cheered, Rosalind Harper proved the naysayers wrong. Rosalind Christine Harper. Not once, but twice. Rosalind Christine Harper. <laughs> As she received two bachelor's degrees, one in nursing, the other in liberal studies. I felt really happy, happy for my mom because it's really good that she graduated and I'm really proud for her. It wasn't easy. In addition to raising seven children, Harper had to find time to attend classes and study. Her desperate search for financial aid became a full-time job. There were, there were tears. I cried this summer because I thought I was gonna be, wasn't going to be able to go through, through the financial aid. Harper had a special reason to keep going. She just couldn't give up. My kids kept me going, you know, knowing that I, I was making it better for them. As mom was studying her lessons, her children were also learning something they don't teach you in school. Just to always keep your head up and you can complete what you start. Are you going to graduate from college one day? Yeah. And her advice to us, never ever give up. In Edwardsville, Tony Miller, CW 11 News. What a great story. Rosalind will take a few months off to work and then it's back to school where she plans to earn her master's degree.